Surprise, motherfuckers! <laughs> I told you at the end of the Nate Talks, y'all weren't seeing this coming. Maybe some, I don't fucking know. Probably didn't, but we're just not even gonna try to do anything. We're just hopping into it. I would assume probably we want to look at this. Okay, wait, why are we in Japan? We don't give a shit, wait, what? Uh-oh. Ah, it's East Coast. We about to find out. I mean, I didn't think that there was going to be a particularly huge amount of people playing the game. Like, that was a very unlikely... How do I remember there's the controls? It was a very unlikely thing, right? Like, there was... It was very... Probably wasn't about to happen. Do you think that's actually a four-bar connection, or you think it's bullshitting me? I'll bet you money is bullshitting me, but let's... You know what? Let's try it. I'm here. Let's do it. Let's play. I can't remember what I'm doing. I don't even know if my buttons are set up right. We're playing on stick, though. Like, this is exciting. I didn't get to play Blaze Blue. Oh, this is not a good sign that it's taking this long to connect. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> I do remember this. Not this specific part, so I guess, yeah, I guess we don't get to play. But I do remember this whole thing about it not showing me actual connections. God damn it. I'm sorry. And so, because of that, like, I just kind of got to go in and hope. Like, these are not all four-bar connections. I promise you that shit. Hello there, person that's hiding, but not really, because Talcaca's on your head. Ha <laughs> ha. Fuck. Um. Well, damn. This is, not a, this is not a good start so far. Let's just check this out. Let's see what's going on. That is good enough. Let's go, actually. All two bars, huh? Let's go into this one. Aries Unchained. That is familiar, I think. It's my bed. It's my bed now. So, what can I do while I'm in here? Oh, look at that. We got some reds. Uh-oh, I'm supposed to be the third best person in the room. The pressure! So I can't do anything. It's okay. So obviously, it's been some time. I don't even remember the last time I played this game. So the reason I actually got it, two reasons. Firstly, and I'm not going to get into it, so I'm going to mention it first. King of Fighters 14 is not sitting well with me at the moment. I need. I mean, I, I'm that's. I'm not really solidified yet on. I think I mentioned this in the Nate talks actually. I just. I haven't solidified my thoughts on it. I haven't got enough experience to be able to say one way or another whether or not these thoughts are correct or if it's just because of inexperience and I need to learn matchups and answers before I can actually say this is how it is but as it is right now without all those elements there's a bunch of little things within the game that just are not sitting well with me and because of that um, it's kind of ruining the experience for me it's preventing me from wanting to continue to play to continue to learn and so because of that like that was one factor why I ended up getting this. The second factor, get, I got this from I bought this from GameFly, and um, they had a sale going on, like a ton of used games under twenty dollars. So I saw that sale and I was like, all right, let's just browse through it, see what's going on, see if anything stands out. And sure enough, I found this game. It was at fifteen bucks. I was like, oh hell yeah, let's get it. <laughs> so I bought it. And if you don't if you know anything about GameFly, if you've never had a GameFly uh, membership, they give you a five dollar coupon every six months that you can use to just take five dollars off a purchase of a game and I haven't bought a game from Gamefly in ages I so I was just scrolling through you know like just clicking through everything as fast as I could like I'm not looking at anything I know this all works click it all through purchase BAM done we good fuck I had five dollars I could have taken off I could have got it for even less and so I you know entered a support ticket hey man uh, I'm stupid I forgot to apply my five dollar coupon would y'all be nice enough to just, you know, handle it for me after the fact because I figure it's a recent purchase, you know, maybe it'll work out. And so they send it back to me. Nope. We look forward to your next purchase where we can, uh, <laughs> where you can uh, then choose to apply your $5 coupon. Like, God damn it. It's funny, too, because they're always so nice about it, right? Like, it's my fault. I'm, it's my fault for being an idiot. I am not entitled to getting that $5 off. I should have clicked that shit myself. And so you have to imagine the person on the other side of that screen has to be sitting there and thinking, this dumb motherfucker wants me to just make his mistake never happen so he doesn't have to learn from it. 
he just has to whine and complain enough. And I kind of wonder whether or not that would actually work out if I was like, well, how about you let me speak to your manager, bitch? You know, like, just raise a bit of a ruckus all over $5. And then they finally get to the point where they're just like, fuck it, it's not even worth the trouble. Like, that's what it always ends up being, right? It's not because the customer is actually correct about, you know, like what they're complaining about. It's not because they should uh, be getting whatever they're complaining about. It's just because the person has, they're done. They don't want to deal with that nonsense anymore. Fuck it. Just get out of my life. I'll do whatever you say, provided you get the fuck out. <laughs> and so, but anyway, so it's that kind of thing where it's like, I'm the kind of person that I actually hate the whole customer service. You have to be as polite and nice as possible to everybody in the world. It doesn't sit right. It's not natural. It just, it's stupid. And so like, I, I'm sitting there thinking like, they could have very well just sent me an email like, you fucking idiot. No, it's your own fault that you are stupid, and I would have accepted it and been perfectly fine with it. And I kind of wish they had, but they didn't. What was that, Robo Rachel? I don't think I've ever seen that color before. It's been so long since I've played this game. I guess there were really three reasons. The fact that Central Fiction's coming out may as well get a little bit back into Blaze Blue, right? Get a little bit of experience initially. I mean, especially because, like I mentioned, I when I got this, I rented it from Gamefly. I didn't purchase it at the start, so I didn't have a PS4 stick at the time. So I was playing on pad. So I haven't played Blaze Blue on stick in ages. Basically since Chrono Phantasma 1.1. Did Tarumi give up? The connection does look like it might be laggy, which would probably cause a give up. I don't know. Should he use 2C? A little downward slash that has a ridiculous range. This is the most pathetic teabagging I've ever seen. It's so slow. I'm so excited that this is the first match that we get to watch. Been away from Blaze Blue for ages. And this is what, like, I don't know what it is with fighting games recently. Anything I try to record ends up being some bullshit like this. It's not like, oh man, this is some really quality gameplay going on right now. We got some serious competition. Uh, two very highly capable individuals going at it showing us the peak of blaze blue potential no it's people that don't even know how to combo yet and just doing full screen supers oh dear god why am i here what am i doing oh no I actually i don't even know if my buttons are set up correctly i assume they would be but i'm not actually sure can I actually, like, can I do that from the lobby? Well, it won't matter, because I'm going to get sent straight into other places. No, I can't. Unless, no, this isn't, because that's the wrong thing. That's the share button, and share doesn't take me somewhere I want to go. So, yeah, I got some shit out of luck. Hopefully my buttons are right, unless you can do it here. I think you can't, yeah, down there, button settings. So I'll be able to run through it really quickly. Not only do we have that first match as the initial match, we just gotta be showing me a showcase of why I hate Blaze Blue to begin with. Showing me all the characters that I can't stand. Rachel, Hazuma, Tsurumi. All I need now is a Lychee, a Kokonoe. Is this motherfucker actually advertising his Tumblr account? <laughs> and their icon? That's amazing. Who else? Do we just absolutely hate Lambda and New both? Although it's gonna be switched around in Central Fiction, right? Nobody plays New anymore. Everybody switched to Lambda because she's better. That's just how that situation is gonna be, right? Whichever one's better, that's gonna be one that gets played. Because even though there are some differences in their gameplay, they're not enough. I 
That dude is just hitting whatever that button is, I assume 2C. It's like every single time Hazuma even moves, bam, 2C. But you can't blame him for it, it's fucking working. So happy this character's in the game. Isn't he getting better too in Central Fiction? Didn't they buff him? It's gonna be fucking exciting. I can't goddamn wait. I hate that character so much. Actually, come to think of it, I'm gonna look this up real quick. Because I was thinking it was just kind of swirling around in my head. A lot of people at the early stages of Central Fiction were kind of declaring that uh, Hazma was dead, they ruined the character, blah blah blah. And it, their examples were Mitsurugi had just dropped, apparently just dropped off the face of the earth, wasn't playing the game anymore, who was the best Hosma player. Prior to that, another prominent Hosma player named Jay Anson switched to Tarumi for a while, but he switched back to Hosma now. But I was curious whether or not, oh, apparently Mitsurugi is a thing that's actually in the story. Hmm. Oh, maybe right here. Fenrich talks about his views on Blaze Blue Central Fiction. Maybe he'll talk about Mitsu. Maybe he'll talk about that. Like, they ruined Azuma. Nope, never mind. Hey, look at that. Fenrich saying that uh, all you gotta do is counter picking with Noel and you'll beat him. <laughs> Are there any characters you fight well against? Characters you don't like fighting against, and the one that he says he doesn't like fighting against is Noel because he doesn't get to fight against her much. Which makes sense. Like, there's not many. There haven't really been very many Noel players in general since. Um, what's it called? Basically since Continuum Shift, where she was top tier, and then she's just kind of dive-bombed ever since then. Damn, man, I'm never gonna get to play. Oh, I think I gotta wait- do I have to wait for that Hellgraver person, too? Are we just gonna sit here for, like, 30 minutes before I ever even get to play? God damn it. I should have gotten- that's just a dick move. Picking Rachel against Tager. Actually, you know what? I- I think I would actually prefer. Yo, shout outs to Hit 'em High, Hit 'em Low. Best Space Jam song, you heard it here first. I think I would actually prefer fighting Rachel as Tager than I would Amane. Because at least Rachel has to come in on you, right? Amane can just keep his distance forever. Rachel gotta run that rush down eventually. I suggest you surrender. Man, good God. I made a post on the Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 2 message board for Game FAQs about how the power of friendship concept that pervades JRPGs lately is irksome to me. Like, that was really it. I wasn't trying to make this, like, big argument about how it ruins storytelling is this terrible thing. I was just kind of like, it just, it's kind of nonsensical to me. Can somebody try and, you know, explain to me the logic behind, you know, like, why this is so pervasive throughout Japanese storytelling in general? And, oh boy, are there some legitimately, uh, antagonistic posts going. Like, the one that I just opened it up to. Listen, child! It starts with that. Like, you know you're in for a fucking ride when somebody starts a post with, listen, child. God damn, he just got perfect and you poor bastard! But yeah, I stopped paying attention to it, like, 80 posts ago. Because somebody started arguing that whatever happens in war is just, that's what happens. War is not an inherently evil thing. And soldiers sign up for what they get. 
so they just, I guess, deserve it, apparently. Like, that was the argument, so I just, like, peace, I'm out. Oh, let's go, Tager. Let's go, Tager. Do your shit. Oh, look at that. It's old Gadget Finger that actually works and is worth using. <laughs> God damn it. I'm actually kind of curious. Because Age... Ooh, did he just... Nope, he doesn't have the meter. He was close. Oh! Oh! Uh oh! You fuck. He brought her to him. Magnetism plus wind. Rachel is flying. But I'm curious because very early on, I saw Grandia doing... With Tiger, you could actually link a 5A after a gadget finger. And because of that, it gave you... It basically it forced a stand reset that gave you more advantage and more options than just doing raw gadget finger. And everybody stopped using that that I saw. Like nobody he was the only person that was using it. And then when I look at recent matches of him, he's never using it anymore. And it kinda like was I overestimating the goodness of the option? What was I oh man, come on, we're in the corner. You got a sledge after that. A raw 5D counter hit into a corner combo? You gotta confirm that. Uh oh. I forgot the purple throws were a thing. Please don't do those against me. I'll get hit by every single one. Bruh! Confirm! Atomic. Has this dude even used this? I don't think this player has actually used a single Atomic Collider now that I think about it. I haven't seen one. Like, she was just floating literally directly inside of where Atomic Collider would grab. It would just happen instantly if he had thrown it out. Hey, you cannot let people just float around in the air freely without at least some kind of danger to it. Not with Tager. I mean, that's an important thing, right? Like, you magnetize somebody, you gotta control their movement. You gotta control the neutral at that point in time. Why do you have to press it twice? Why do you have to ready up and then ready up again? Look at that! It saved my color from like a year ago, whenever the last time I played this shit was. Alright, y'all ready to see me get- Oh, I didn't check my buttons. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, we're gonna check them live. And just hope that shit works. Seriously, I only have 11 player matches total? Damn, I didn't play this game very much, did I? I forgot to take off my shoes and my feet start getting uncomfortable. My own fault. I kind of cramped myself in here a little bit because I got a little table in front of me that kind of holds my microphone, holds the capture. Got my water on it. Got a little grip strengthener thingy. I got some other stuff. All right, here we go. Let's see. Is this backdash? Is this C? Oh, I'm so fucked. Oh dear God, that C? Why is that C? I lost. Are there auto combos in this game? Can I just mash A at some point? Like, I'm I'm so fucked. I, uh, I'm so fucked. Half of my buttons are wrong. B and A are switch. C is on the right side of D. Actually, I don't even know if that button is D. Is this button... Just let me hit a button real quick, please. Please. Cool, we're back in neutral. That's D. All right, cool. So my D is correct. It's the only button that is. Oh boy, I can't even I can't even bear your properly so I don't know which buttons to press. Why did I not go into button settings? God damn it! We're back, people! Gustav! Yes, I did it correctly! I keep hitting C instead of D. Help! Send aid! I need it so badly! Oh my god! Oh boy! Oh my god, that's not C! Shit! <laughs> Help! God damn it. This was fun! Oops! What? How did that? I just tried to bury her and I got 5D. Oh fuck! Oh, that's amazing! It's so dumb that I can't go into options just from this regular menu. That's fucking phenomenal. <laughs> oh, man. And by the time my turn actually rolls around... You know what? I'm actually just gonna leave, because, like... 
All we're gonna do is just sit here and watch that dude beat everybody's ass, and that's not fun for anybody. I mean, maybe I might have... I wouldn't have been able to do anything. Maybe. Very, very unlikely. I mean, you know, you're coming in. What am I trying to do here? Buttons. There we go. Holy shit. Wait, no, that wasn't even right. I just... I just assigned King of Fighters buttons. <laughs> okay, let's get rid of all of the... No, that's the wrong shit. That's share. Wow, that is a new menu. That did get me the fuck out. I don't want to be here. What's the... How do... What do I press to get rid of shit? I have to hold right? God damn it, that's stupid. Why did they get rid of the select button, man? This is irritating that they got rid of the select button. Alright, cool. We good. Should I should I bind taunt? We should totally have taunt in here. Why not? Alright, now that I, now I actually have you know what let's do? Let's roll it back to the classic. Alright, let's do this. Let's relearn this game. Cause I I mean, granted, it didn't help. I should I should not have started trying to play competitive like a me or not competitive, but you know what I mean. I should have at least done a, like a trial run or two of some kind of single player shit just so I can regain the muscle memory, remember which buttons I'm trying to fucking press, all that good shit. Oh, that's good. I pressed the button. It didn't even come out. What's fuck? I what? What? I completely forgot everything. Like, it, I, I would not have won. Whoa! Oh, fuck. I thought she had to land. It's an unlimited character. Why would she have to have recovery? That's silly. Shit, I didn't get double jump. I forgot how to double jump. That work in central fiction. Uh oh, uh oh. How do I wreck us? How do I wreck us? How did that grab me? She was mad far away. Quarter circle forward, back forward, forward. I think I just did forward. I don't think I did the back in there. Cool. We remembered. That should have, that should have, Rekka should have been in there somewhere. Oh my god, oh my god. I should have 5 day 5 aid. I don't know why I just tried to uh, growl her in the air. That should work! You should be able to growl her in the air, that should be a thing. Wow, I have no timing whatsoever for double jumping. I have no timing whatsoever for everything. Like, I can't remember all the, uh, timings for, like, when I recover from dashes and shit. Wait, how was I not? Huh. Do I remember the nope, don't remember the timing for doing a Whoa! I was not expecting her to be behind me. I was blocking low and she went low. Interessante. Let's try that again. I should have been here first. I should have been here first. That was fucking phenomenal. Can't believe my buttons weren't even correct. Jesus Christ. I forgot too because it's basically the way the pad, I mean the way buttons are laid out is that, so you have um, four face buttons. And the way the four face buttons are set up are the first four buttons on the stick. Whereas you want um, three buttons up top. A, B, C, well, or B, C, D, depending on your layout. Like, I think one, of, I think the traditional arcade layout is actually A on the bottom left, and then the three buttons after that are B, C, D, because that's kind of, sort of, Guilty Gear. But Guilty Gear has one more button. Alright, that crossed me up. Why? Why, though? Fuck! Whoa! Oh my god, I got some work to do. Nate got himself some work to do. That's right, I forgot. I can't do that. I gotta do... Damn, that was a lot of damage! 
Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Do that, but I'll take it. God damn, bitch. I don't know why I hit a button there. That had a lower trajectory than I was expecting. I thought I'd be able to just sit under it and maybe punish her as she came down, but I don't get to do nothing. Why wouldn't you why why aren't you using why are you not giving me your abusable Invincible back that oh shit. Oh, I can't burst. Oh, this is a lot of damage. I've been hit twice I've been I've been hit twice. I Just got unblockable resetted by the fucking AI. Are you real? I was not expecting that I was not expecting that but at least I confirmed it I Beat my fucking growler shit. What's it called? Panzer shot something or other. I don't fucking know. I don't know. I don't remember move names. I don't remember how to play this game. I don't know how to do nothing, man. Why am I here? Why did I buy this game? I wasted my money. I'm just gonna fucking die over and over. I'm gonna embarrass myself. You know what? Let's stop embarrassing ourselves. We remember how to play Tagger. Who? It's impossible to forget how to play Tagger. You just mash 360s all fucking day. It'll be fine. God damn it, son of a bitch. I'm the worst place group player in the world. Why are we here? This is a stupid color. Why did I pick this color? Fuck you, bitch. Shit. Oh, dear God. Ha! Son of a dick. I can't do anything now. I forgot about that. Oh! Nope, didn't confirm it. What am I doing? I have forgotten combos. I have forgotten everything. Cool! I let her out of the corner, because that's how we do. Cool! That was not what I wanted. I wanted a 3C. What? What exactly just happened? This- no, that does not work. Good thing to me- it just didn't even come out, son of a bitch. I can do 360s again. I remember struggling so terribly with those on pad. At least I can do that now. At least I remember how to fucking 360. Wow! Wow! <laughs> oh, she's not magnetized no more. What? 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 This is the combo I remembered! Ha <laughs> ha! I'm back to the good. I, I forgot. I, I, I fucked it up. I fucked it up. I fucked it up. It's okay. It's okay. 100%, right? Remember? I remember that shit. Whoops! Can you not? Oh my god. Oh, that's an overhead. Oh, I'm dead. Maybe? Maybe? I'm not dead. I'm alive. I'm, de I'm dead. Fuck. What are overheads? How do I block those? It's impossible. It's not, this is an it's not an overhead, it's an unblockable. Trust me. I know what I'm talking about. I can't even do sledges! Jesus! Fuck! I can't even instant block! Oh my god, I forgot about that bullshit. Oh my god, I forgot about that bullshit. Damn it. Damn it. Stop! Should have astral? That's way too early. Holy crap, that was so early. Fuck your old job. Oh god, fuck me. Oh no, oh no, that's gonna be like 5k. Easy. Please don't do more than 5k. Ah, I won! Look at that, I won me around. Tagger's so easy to use. <laughs> I gotta remember to do that float shit though. And I gotta remember when I can do a sledge off of it to get a 5b follow up and when I can't. No, you do that when they're not magnetized and you do 5c instead of the float shit. I remember. 
I had forgotten that worked. What am I doing with my life? <laughs> oh dear god! Bitch! What am I doing? Oh god. My all of my life? Oh no. All of my life? Help. Help. That's right, come to Papa! Come to Big Papa! Oi, Poppy! I Dios mio! I don't even know what the fuck that means. I'm taking Italian, I'm speaking Spanish. It makes fucking sense. That didn't hit! What the hell? Stop getting hit airborne! I don't know what to do! Oh, fuck. Planned? All planned? Uh, what are, co what are, what are corner combos? Oh, god, that's, that, that's right. I, I kind of remember. Maybe. Possibly. What the fuck?! Oh, shit! I think I, I can... Well, it doesn't matter now. He's dead. Never mind. Shit. Help. You're coming to Big Papa again, oh boy! <laughs> I won two matches! I'm so good at this game! I guess I should just play Tager. <laughs> ah, ah, fuck. Ah, Jesus. Oh no, I forgot the pain, the torture that is this character. Help! Oh god. Oh no. What have I done? What mistakes have led me here? Why with that damage? Fuck your parry. Perfect. Oh wait, that's right! You can do... Right? Like, this works. Shit. Well, I mean, yeah, that, that does work. I wasn't incorrect about that, but what I wanted to do... Yeah! Ah Intentional! I'm dead, aren't I? I'm actually dead here. Oh, God. Help. Please, no. Oh, wow, I'm not. I thought that did, like, 5k. Oh no! Oh okay, we're good, we're good. I, I knew that was gonna happen. It's cool, I'm remembering shit. Like, this is fun, just kind of like remembering shit off the top of my head that's not gonna work anymore in Blaze Blue Central Fiction, because fuck that game. What? Well, I. I just. I, I can't do 6A apparently. Like, how do you do that command? I don't fucking know. Oh, that's right, you have to 5D after that if they're magnetized, but she had lost magnetism, so it wouldn't have worked. Anyway, I thought. For some reason, it was in my head that I could Atomic Collider after that. Help. Told you, man. Purple throws, you hit me. I actually tried to um, 360B punish that, so I was kind of expecting that to happen instead of, you know, getting fucking destroyed. I need to remember that shit. And she lost magnetism anyway, so it didn't even matter. I didn't even pull her in. Because you used to be able to, um, off of that, you actually used to be able to do... They would be... Oh, shit, did I... No, 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 okay. You used to be able... They counted as prone, and so because of that, you were, you were actually able to gadget finger them back in. But that doesn't work anymore, so that's why I keep get, just getting random 2Ds. Nope, lost magnetism. Ah, shit. Oh, that's right! I forgot that wall! Ow! Oh, no. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Never get parried by Makoto. It's so much... Actually, it's a lot less now, isn't it? Than it used to be. It's just, you know, this character. What the fuck? That wasn't... Uh-oh. Hey! Fuck! Well, I'm dead. Well, I mean, you know, we won a couple rounds. We're getting there. We're remembering shit. It's okay.
okay. We're gonna get there eventually. I'm way too tired. I'm actually I'm not that tired, but I am starving. Um, today was a wonderful day for me. I got called into work unexpectedly, and so I woke up a lot. Like I didn't. I was expecting to get a lot more sleep in the morning than I actually got, and so I went into work. I came home, immediately passed out, slept through two of my classes, and by the time I woke up, it was basically time for my third. So I had to just hop out of bed, shower, all that shit, and run straight to school. I have not had anything to eat. Basically, in about 16 hours, I have not eaten anything. I put some chicken out to thaw so I can barbecue the shit out of it, make myself some chicken saiza salad. Can't wait for that, but, uh, I need to do that before I can come back here and play. But, I mean, that's good, though. Like, it's... Let me just search for this shit again real quick. It's good that there's, you know, still some people playing. You're a green... <laughs> Excuse me. You're a green square? And you're asking for pros? Like, homie, you gotta at least... See, look at me. I'm orange. You saw my performance, man. That is the mark of a true pro. Fucker asking for... Green squared motherfucker asking for pros, please. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, man, that brought back, man. I looked at my little thing over there, my, uh... 20 matches and 12 wins, that's ranked. Didn't I lose, like, all 8 of those to Zong? Isn't that what happened there? <laughs> like, more or less. Anyway... Thank you for watching. We back, boys, with some Blaze Blue. Let's see what happens.